up, y'all? This is Critic, and today we're going to be reacting to Last Night in Soho. Now, I don't know what this movie is really about, but I do know that the person that's directing this movie is Edgar Wright. Now, if y'all don't know who Edgar Wright is, let me just introduce y'all to the movies he's done. He's done Shaun of the Dead, Hot Fuzz, Scott Pilgrim vs. The World, The World's End, and Baby Driver, but we're not going to talk about that. And he's directing this movie. This is his new movie. And it, inter and it stars one of the hottest actresses that's out right now, Anya Taylor-Joy, who did The Witch, an A24 film. She did uh, the M. Night Shyamalan movies, with, you know, Samuel Jackson and Bruce Willis, you know, the Unbreakable trilogy. And she was also in the one of the hottest shows that was out on Netflix the past year, The Queen's Gambit. So it also has Thomas McKenzie, who's one of the up-and-coming actresses out right now. So we're going to be reacting to it. Uh, I heard the trailer is like really nice, so we're going to be checking it out. I like all of Edgar Wright's films. And uh, yeah, let's just check it out right now. So let's go. Ooh, that's a nice shot right there. When you're alone and life is making you lonely, you can know Looks very cinematic. Down. Like that. Down, down. Yep, baby and driver. You've got troubles, all the noise and the hurry seems to help. I know. Downtown. Yeah, she must be living in a shitty apartment. Just listen Back in time. to the music of the traffic in the city. Can't no theater. Huh. Around the sidewalks where the neon signs are pretty. Ow. Is that how you tell you joy singing? What the fuck? What? What? The lights are much brighter there. You can forget all your troubles, forget all your cares. So go downtown. Things will what is be going on here? Is that supposed to be like her ego or something like that? Everyone's waiting for you. Yo, this strong look out of pocket. What the fuck? <laughs> Everyone's waiting for you. Yo. It's like ghosts and shit. Do you believe in ghosts? Like I said, ghosts. Oh, shit. Oh, this show wow. Oh, I thought it freeze from me. I was getting scared. <laughs> Last night in Seoul. Okay, that was Last Night in Soho, and it looks pretty interesting. It looks very cinematic. You, f The first thing you see is Anya Taylor Joy's silhouette. Uh, showing in front of the stage or whatever, and then you see this girl. I don't know his name. I don't know her name, but I know it's Thomas McKenzie who's playing this girl. I guess she's our lead, and she's trying to like live a different life. Um, she's interested in theater. I'm guessing through the trailer, but then she goes to this hotel, and I guess Anya Taylor, Anya Taylor Johnson is the ghost, and she starts like messing with her throughout the film or whatever. That's what I'm guessing, and it's gonna be some type of psychological horror. I think we're going to get like, remember that movie with uh, Natalie Portman, Black Swan? I think it's going to be like that type of film where she's going to go crazy throughout the film and we're going to find out why. Probably like her past trauma or something like that. But they say it's ghost, so it's probably a little bit different. But uh, yeah, it looks pretty interesting. It got different shots that are like very cinematic, like I said before, like neon colors. I like neon colors to remind me of like Blade Runner and it looks cool, it looks interesting. So yeah, I'm really interested in Last Night and So.